here we are with a rib. We have 24 ribs all together, two sets of 12, a left and a right, so we just name them nicely, ribs 1 through 12. Uh, and in our course, we do not ask you to determine the difference between ribs number 7 and rib number 8. So we take a look at ribs as a generality. Let's take a look at, as we always start off with, the laterality. Is this a left or a right rib? And the way that we do this is by describing the different structures that we find. So let's take a look at a couple ends. Notice how one side looks as if it's snapped off. The other side looked as if it's formed. One side of it really does articulate with other bones. The snapped off portion articulates with the coastal cartilage. And so let's begin to compare. You can see this one clearly looks like something got broken off. And then this one does look like it's kind of formed. The formed end is what we call the head. And the head attaches to vertebrae at, those, at the, uh, the body. While, of course, the tubercle of the rib, so if we got the head, the neck, leads up to this big bump that's called the tubercle of the rib, attaches to the transverse process. So, so far we have the head, the neck, and the transverse, pro uh, the tubercle. These are always posterior. Okay, great. So now I have one that faces this way or faces this way. Well, how do I determine if it's on this side or that side? Well, let's take a look at the last marking that we're going to be exploring, and that is, or two more markings, one which you call the coastal groove. It's hard to see on a video here, but if you feel your own ribs, you can actually see this little shadow of this groove in which nerves and arteries and veins will rest upon. And so this is always inferior, so you aim it down. All right, so now I have posterior uh, and then inferior. The last one is lateral. Well, the lateral one is what we call the coastal angle. The angle kind of makes this peak in which the rib bends, and of course, that's the coastal angle. That is always lateral, so this would, of course, in my left rib. Let's review. Head, neck, tubercle, angle, coastal angle, and coastal groove.